Hey guys, welcome to another Myth of Empires video, and today we'll be looking at vagrants. More specifically, we'll be going over where to find them, how to recruit them, how to manage them, and how to best utilize them in combat. So without further ado, let's get into it. You can find vagrants located all over the map at these stronghold icons. If you're initially struggling to find a stronghold, I would recommend traveling along the road, as they usually set camp near the roadway. You'll know you spotted vagrants when you see their campfire with them sitting next to it. From there, you're free to approach them and press E to talk to them. You can then press the recruit button, give them their desired item by pressing confirm, and then claim them by giving them a name if you wish to do so. From here, the vagrant is yours to command as you choose. Now, let's learn about how to manage your Vagrant by going over the commands from which you can choose from. The Vagrant action bar, ranging from F1 to F8, allows you to see all the given commands. F1 can control the Vagrant's movement, allowing them to go to a designated area, follow you, attack freely, or stay still. F2 allows you to create formations with multiple Vagrants, however you'll need to progress through the tech tree to hire multiple Vagrants at the same time. F3 changes their method of combat, as you can command them to attack with a ranged weapon, melee weapon, or their weapon of choice. We'll have to make sure they're equipped with the appropriate weapon, so we'll cover that later in the video. F4 allows them to mount or dismount if they are provided with a horse. F5 commands the Vagrant to attack your target. F6 changes their battle stance from active, neutral, or passive. F7 allows them to patrol a certain area, either near, medium, or far. And F8 commands them to rescue a fallen ally in need. Now that we know how to control our vagrants, we can equip them with armor for combat. You can do so by speaking with them and opening their inventory. From here, you can select your armor provided and drag and drop each piece into the appropriate slot. We'll also have to feed our vagrants to keep them from starving. You can do this by talking to them and opening their inventory, followed by dragging and dropping them cooked food. From here, you can right click on the food and press feed. Your vagrants hunger can be tracked by checking the blue bar located just under their health bar. Be sure to keep this in mind to avoid starving your vagrant by accident. When it comes to combat, I would recommend equipping your Vagrant with a bow and arrows, as they seem to have an easier time landing attacks with ranged weapons. With this, you can tank the damage yourself, while your Vagrant does damage from afar. Unfortunately, Vagrants currently struggle when it comes to melee attacks. There seems to be an issue when they try to attack things directly in front of them, missing the hitbox of the enemy over and over again. Let me know in the comments if you've had better luck with Vagrants and melee weapons. As a workaround, I've equipped my Vagrant with heavier armor to tank the damage from mobs. With this, I can at least use the Vagrant to tank damage while I deal the majority of the damage myself. I hope this guide has helped you learn a bit more about Vagrants and how to use them in combat. I'm looking forward to being able to recruit multiple Vagrants as I feel they're going to be very useful as the game progresses. If you guys like this content, be sure to like the video and subscribe for new videos every Sunday. Thanks guys, take care.